already in arms. Is this like Bebop? Or Rocksteady from Teenage Teenage Mutant and Ninja Turtles? Oh god, not again. It's a big ass big on the couch. I didn't even know it. Oh. Oh, hey, Big B. It's me. I'm in your chair, huh? I'm tired, Colin. It's been a long day. Got a smoke? Thanks. Couple thousand more of these, we'll be even on that house you owe me. This has got to stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Big B. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Come on. That's a little dramatic. That for me? Nope. The house didn't blow itself down, Big B. That's all I'm saying. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh... It would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. It also would have shown everyone how different you are now. It's gonna make you feel guilty. Uh, let's take a fix. Nice. nice. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. So, everyone hates me. Nah, I'm just giving you shit. I'm doing my best here. Clearly that is not true. What with the selfishness with the bourbon. But, uh, no. Um, hate's the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. You ate a lot of people back in your day. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories either. Look, I'm not saying it's fair. But it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, look at your hands. Uh, I do have meat knuckles. Who'd you get in a fight with? A fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. I was doing my job, believe it or not. Your job is to beat the shit out of fables? Sometimes I take them to the farm. You know what I mean? <laughs> Fuck you. You think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. And being By right. being big and being bad. Don't say that shit in front of people. It's embarrassing. That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. Mm, not everyone. No. Name one. Not really. I'm fucking cool. I don't actually know her name. Awesome. Great example. Life is easier with friends, Bigby. And we live a long fucking time. I know you like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Well, maybe if my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. Wait, that doesn't make sense. Just give sense. me a drink, please. Colin, enough already. I haven't slept in two days. I went out a second story window, and I want to get in two seconds of shut-eye before I... Look, if I give you this, will you let me sleep? Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. 
You have a big whiskey? Thanks, Big B. He's recovering alcohol. No. What? Sorry, I'm... Snoodle. What is it? Where are we going? Where are we going? Out in front of the building. We have to get there. Hi. By walk. Hello. Good morning. Or evening. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> These walls are paper thin. We need to be careful. We'll talk outside. This girl is. She's not a Mundy, right? Who was she? I thought I knew everyone in Fable Town. Just she looks girl. familiar. Just a girl. We didn't have a whole lot of time to chat. The woodsman. He attacked her, and I stepped in. And he threatened to kill us both. No. You don't think he... I don't think anything yet. Just give me a second. It's just... terrible. So, did you see anyone else? No. No one. No cabs, no voices, Mondays? Maybe, No dude but... with an axe sticking no. his head. No. I don't think so. I would remember. Okay. Big P, did one of... us? Do this? There hasn't been a murder in Fable Town in a long time. Well, she's All the more murdered. reason we shouldn't start a panic before we know what's going on. I'll have a look around. We don't have much time before people will be coming through here. She was placed here with some care. What do you mean? You can see that someone didn't just toss her here. She was deliberately placed. For us to find. What kind of monster would do this? Probably a legend. Harry monster. Strange cut. 
What did this to her? Very stumpy. What could do something like that? Either something very sharp, or something with magic attached to it. Sorry, this is just so surreal. <sighs> you know, my head um, what? Yeah. What do you want to do next? We still have some time. I should keep investigating the area. Okay, good idea. Let's check things that aren't the head. Let's start by looking here at this thing. our hands in that blood. Blood. Drops of blood. Drops of blood. I'd say it's been here an hour maybe. Brian. No signs that it's been here long. What signs would you find? Fabric. Looks like jeans. Doesn't tell me much. Doesn't look like jeans. Shit. Just some loose trash. That's uh, how I describe myself. Yep, more blood. Someone might have hopped the fence, got caught, then left the trail I found earlier. Blood. Still wet. Sharp enough. Blood. Still blood like. Slowly. Don't pay any attention to me. are you doing? Better to be thorough. Sure, just hurry up. We don't have much time. We should move her before anyone shows up. We'll find out more at the business office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. Big P, do you have any idea what's going on? How did this happen? This is a message. Why her? This is a message. A message? I don't know, Bigby. I get complaints at the office all the time, but... Just what about this makes you think that? The victim. She could be a symbol for something. I'm gonna have to talk Crane about this. As long as King Cole is gone, he's acting mayor. He needs to know. And he's going to find out anyway, so we may as well get out in front of it. It'll just be worse if he finds out we held it from him. We should wait until we have more to tell him. Right now, all we know is a girl is dead. Telling Crane doesn't change that, and I've got all the motivation I need to find out who did this. That sounds reasonable, but I don't know. I'll think about it. I just don't want him interfering. <laughs> 